Dude, you're not even, I don't even see you on YouTube. My thing I say I stream you on YouTube. Hello, everyone. I'm not sure if you guys are here, if you're watching, if you're not watching. Um, but if you are, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, everybody. I think it's just us, but that's okay. Well, we say hello anyway. Hello, everybody. You can just ask, but that's okay. Oops. Ooh, what the heck was that? I sounded robotic. <laughs> I, had, I, I had to turn off the volume on the YouTube men. It sounded like. That's what it sounded like. Let me share it on Facebook. Oh, thanks. I, I posted um, several on, my, on the group. and If you're all coming in, don't forget to smack that thumb, guys. We need all the views we can possibly get for some reason. It's just not there anymore. We're getting out with only 50 people watching, 50 views. What's up with that? Hi, Young Sue. Hi, Young Sue. She is such my faithful friend. She never, she's always there. Even when she's not in the chat, she's in the, she's out there watching. Yep. Like a little guardian angel. Yep, she is. Okay, so here's what we're doing. We're just hey. touching up. Hello, um, Michelle. Michelle Pipling or Michelle? Evans. Oh, Evans, Evans, I'm sorry. Okay. Evans. Hey, Michelle. Okay, so we're just going in. There's certain little areas where, like, the still a little wet. It's not 100% completely dry um but it's all right we're um we're gonna work around some of it if i can't get to certain areas because it's still wobbly we'll work with where we where we can so i attached this little piece here because it looked like one of those anchor thingies those steering wheels from the ships i don't know what that's called there's a name for it but i don't know what it's yeah. called yeah the helm the helm I don't know what it's called. Yeah, they say take the helm. The helm? H-E-L-M, yeah, helm. <laughs> I'm guessing. I only remember the phrase. I guess that's what that's called. It's like saying take the wheel, take the helm. Take the helm. All right. So we're just touching up here and there. But we got some really nice layers. Hopefully we can get some really nice effects afterwards. So with a small little paintbrush, we can go into the little places where um, in the little nooks and crannies. Yeah, the little nooks and crannies. Especially like the see that right there, it's still wet. It's not a hundred percent dry. Why don't you take the heat gun to it? Um, I don't want it to, you know, no. I want it to try to, and especially um wanted to try to get it natural as best as I can. Um, so I'm just trying to. Oh, Michelle sat with a blow dryer with hers. <laughs> blow dryer. Hey, there, there you go. go. You styling your brush. Mm -hmm. Should be the gel doesn't clearly dry, um, like transparent. It's a little bit, see, white. So in some parts where it doesn't, okay, yeah, you gotta get it, you gotta get it, you know? Just gotta get it. I hope you guys had a wonderful evening, wonderful meal, wonderful dinner. Touch up where we need to touch up. I'm muting myself every time I chew. <laughs> oh, and here I am when I take my um, my ice, I crunch, 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 crunch. <laughs> Y'all know. We're going to go in and try to get a little bit of a shadowing effect, and I'm probably going to go in with a little bit 
um, sprays or alcohol inks to make it look rusty around that twine. Michelle is asking what I'm eating. I'm having a BLT with cheese. I know. I haven't had one of those. She, when she told me that, I'm like, God, I haven't even had one of those ages. Probably, I don't know. It's been a long time for me. Yeah, five or ten years. Jeez, it's been that long for me. No, it's been about a year for me. Last yeah. time I had one. I used to have those when I worked in the office. Um, we're talking about before child number two. So that just tells you how long it's been. That sounds really yummy, though. You well, know what I love? I love tomato sandwiches. Oh, yeah. my God. Mm -hmm. I have a tomato sandwich with just bread, some salt, a little bit of mayonnaise. Oh, my gosh. That mm -hmm. is so good. Michelle says, I don't remember the last time I had one, but I'll try this week. Go for it, girl. It's, it's good. Yeah, maybe we all have a chain reaction because now I have some bacon in the refrigerator. Mm -hmm. That's what she's saying. That's what Michelle's saying. I have bacon in the freezer. Yeah. Bacon in there. Whip it out. Maybe, um, maybe I can have one of those. And my son loves bacon, so maybe we can have a lunch with BLT. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you can get bored being in the house all day. What am I going to eat? What am I going to eat? What right. Gonna eat? It's hard to figure out with these kids, you know, what are we Especially doing? Especially with the kids. You know, when they're in school, we pack them a lunch. Um, but here, it's like, okay, go eat more because we're here. So when you pack them on lunch for school, you pack them quick things that they can have. Because they can't have microwaves or they don't have microwaves or anything like that. So here we have to pack them. I mean, we have to make them lunch, lunch. All right. So we kind of hit certain little areas that needed to be kind of. Hey, Rose. I don't know if you wanted to come on or not. Um, oh, you got something in the works, Rose? There you go. So we got a nice little um, effect there. Like I said, we put the helm. Is that what it's called, helm? You'll probably ask me tomorrow, what is that steering thing that steers the ships? And I probably will not remember. Okay, so guys, don't forget to smack the thumbs up. I don't know, honestly, what is up with YouTube? Five people watching, that's it that we have. I mean... Rose, yeah. put some honey in it or some sugar. And maybe you could put some milk in there, too. In she's, what? She's drinking hot tea, and she says, yuck, how do you people drink this crap? What, tea? Tea, I, yeah. Oh, I just drink it like that. I don't even put no sugar, no honey, no oh, nothing. Oh, no. I don't put nothing. I just drink it just like that. I always drink unsweet tea and uh, un, unsweet coffee. No milk. There is that. I want to show you while this one's a little bit still a little bit still wet and I don't want to mess too much with some of my little gears and stuff because I don't want that to come apart um so we work so hard I was right I looked it up I was right I looked it up it's called the helm H-E-L-M -E mm -hmm. there you go she got it right see that's a little wobbly wobbly we attach that off camera because I saw that on my desk and I said that would be perfect. It looks like the helm. <laughs> there you go. All right. So um this is the leftover one of the leftover pieces from the paper that we use here, the rice paper. And um Ooh, look how pretty that is. You can use um like thick uh, varnish gloss high gloss or mod podge to Hi, see honey. Hey, Miss Penny. Um, so what I would do is I would Mod Podge and then I would seal it with some type of a varnish. And what it is, it's just a regular tile um, that you can purchase. Question, if you don't have um, uh, the sealant that you said, the varnish, can you use hairspray to seal it? Will that work? And then maybe a coat of Mod Podge or something? 
hairspray? I've never heard of. I've heard of hairspray as a sealant. Mm, I've but heard I'm wondering if you add Mod Podge over it, if you don't have what you used. I've never heard of that. I mean, you can try. I've used hairspray as a bonding agent, um, but I've never heard of it as, you know, I'm having a sad cry night. Oh, I'm so sorry, Miss Penny. Why are you crying? Why are you crying, sweetheart? No llore. I go to town read the hot tea and lemon with fight. Michelle tea. says I use hairspray on chalk paintings. That I've heard. I've never heard of that. That's the first time I've ever heard of that. I, I heard it as uh, people using it too in the Bible journaling seal. I forgot what though, but I know chalk was one of them and then, then there's another one. Wow, I've never heard of that. What's the matter, Miss Penny? What, what's going on? I'll have to give it a try. I know it's a very, I know hairspray is a good bonding agent. Uh, when you're making sprays like acrylics, uh, those little sprays that we use. You know, I don't believe anything that they're saying. They're saying that the, that that the hot tea is like fighting the virus or whatever. I don't know. I don't believe anything anymore. Did you see my post? They're pulling up uh, trucks for the uh, for the deceased to put them in uh, oh my God. freezer trucks. Oh my God! And I and my cousin sent me a, a video of a soldier that they're sending in the troops for these for these trucks to and to get the bodies out of homes that never even made it to the hospital. Oh my God! I don't even want to talk about that. That is just uh, mm -hmm. it's just one of those things that's that, okay. So here is what we're gonna do while this is drying up. We're gonna set that aside. No, no crying. Nobody cries. Stop crying, everybody. You know, Sue's going to cry because she feels bad because Penny's crying. Nobody cry, please. Look at the pretty brush. Look at the pretty brush. Yeah, no crying, guys. No crying. No crying. No crying. Okay, so we're going to use... If I could make you all a BLT with cheese, I would. Would that make you all feel better? If I had a way to send it, I would. We could use this, and uh, had I cut it a little bit better, let's see if I can cut one that's not. Let's cut her. I like her. I like her. Yes, yeah, sending virtual hugs to everybody. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Stop pacing. Vete para la cama. Vete. Vete por Go. Vete. Good boy. Vete. Vete. Don't stare at me. Go inside. Basically, I'm just trying to wrap it around. Do I want her on? Good boy. I give him three seconds before he jumps out of his room. Three seconds, that's it? Yeah. He's part, uh, uh, what do you call it, um, Jack Russell. So he's like antsy all the time. Ooh, those are, those are, those can terrorize a house. No, he's pretty good because he's a mix. But he makes you crazy walking back and forth. And when he gets the, the energy, like if he doesn't get enough exercise, he starts running around the house like a dog on crack. This one's really nice. Now I could do that if we can lay down another one on the base. Hmm. Well, yeah, where is this, Joyce? It's Joyce well, was here earlier. Yeah. Okay. Read my post, read my post Lulu. What post? Yeah, I'm gonna go see. I don't know. Here's something about hairspray. She said up above. Hairspray makes it sticky. Is what she said up above. All right. So we. Like a perfect one like this is a perfect little square. That's a perfect oh, yeah. tile square right there. See that? But I want to make a whole collection of this too. We're going to probably, because I use a lot of little coasters, especially here with my desk. And 
place your right hand on your left shoulder and your on your wait a minute, place your right hand on your left shoulder and your right hand on the opposite shoulder. And then I need you to squeeze and then you feel my hug. Oh, that is so sweet, Michelle. That's super sweet. Wow. I'm giving uh, social media hugs. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay, so I love these little squares. Just just a tad bit if we could find a square, but you can probably pile it on with another one. So we're not going to use that because that would be a waste, but I wanted to show you with this one what we could do with this. And I just cut these little pieces that were leftovers, and that was perfect little fit to fit here. And so let's get our Mod Podge while that's drying over there. Miss Penny, no crying fit. We don't want no crying. Sorry, Miss Penny, but no crying today. Just think, I saw you. Uh, yeah, you have to think about what's going on in heaven, honey. Yeah. What does it have to do with her brother? Yeah. Did they bury him with him? Did, did they? I don't know. She didn't say. No, she's just remembering. Oh, um, remodeling his mansion up there. Yeah, he's in a better place, Miss Penny. Yeah. He's free of drugs and everything else. Think about that. Amen. And he's with your mom. And he's with your mom and your dad and your brothers. Mm -hmm. Your two baby brothers. Well, one was a baby and one was a teenager, I believe. He's up there. He's in a good place now. He's he is home. Rose is suffering with the tea. <laughs> She's suffering with the tea. It's good for you, Rose. Just think of it. It's it's sweet. Did you put any sugar in That's what, that? I told her. We told her put honey and put. You could put some milk in there or sugar if you don't have honey. But if you're drinking a straight up girl, that's nasty. No, it's not. It to me it is. Bless it. That's like coffee without sugar for me. Oh, I, I, I drink my coffee without sugar. Ah, hey. You drink your coffee with milk and sugar? When I use the creamer, no. When I use the creamer, I don't put any sugar because the creamer has enough. But if I don't have the creamer and I have to use milk, yeah, sugar. See, I can't, I can't have cream. Every now and then I make that, you know, that sacrifice because I love cream, cream and coffee. But it hurts my stomach. Um, Penny says her other brother brother got out, man. I be damned. What? I be damned if he ain't out doing the same old poop. <laughs> is he really? Wow. Oh my God. What is wrong? This is not the right time. If you're not supposed to have sugar because you're diabetic or whatever, Rose, then you could try honey. That's a natural sugar. That's okay. That's there. a natural hope. Yeah, that's a natural sugar. But you got to get the honey that says that it's real honey, not the... Yeah, or the raw sugar. Yeah. Raw sugar be okay. Or, of course, Splenda, and I don't like those. I think those are... No, nasty. I don't like those things, no. They leave... For me, they leave an aftertaste. Yeah, they do. They have a nasty taste. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Gag reflex. Have a gagging thingy. I cannot. My mom used to. My mom was diabetic and she was um, on insulin. Mm. And uh, yeah, she would take that. Ooh, I, uh, mm -mm. That's nice, Michelle. She's gonna add her brother to uh, her prayer her list. Prayers, yeah. Yes, you can do a good prayer. Yeah, you gotta keep positive, Miss Penny. You gotta think that he's in a wonderful place with God and. All your loved ones, it's gone up to meet God, you know, your daddy, your mom. He is such in a wonderful place right now. Maybe not where you want him to be, but, you know, he's in a wonderful place. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. I didn't know that the sugar substitutes can cause uh, Alzheimer's. I had no clue. Um, yeah, that's what statistics um, statistics are always saying that supposedly Splenda and Equal, especially Equal. Hmm. I had heard not Splenda, but I had heard Equal. That's what Bob uses, Splenda. Equal was notorious for it. Right. So we're just using these little scraps because we don't want to waste them. We want to use our scraps the best that we can. While my paintbrush is drying. Okay. 
You want to put a good amount of that glue on there. Again, you can do this with your napkins if you don't have these rice papers, but we are going to be getting these in the store. Penny says, I don't usually curse, but I'm finished. I'm through. I'm not helping no more. You got to set boundaries. Yeah, yeah. If he's back to his old ways, Miss Penny, you need to, you know, let him know. I'm sorry. See, that's not, that's what my brother used to do. My brother that was into drugs, um, thank God he's not anymore, but. You know, when he was in jail, of course, he would promise my mom the stars and the moon. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to touch it anymore. I'm done with that stuff. That's it. No more. I'm a changed man. I found Jesus. Mm -hmm. Yeah, until he got out. He found Jesus until he got out. Then he found the, his uh, friends and the bottle and the drugs. It's They never change. You know, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. I'm using about, I would say about a half inch, depending on how thickness your tile is. I, I guess that would make a huge difference and I should have not let my paintbrush dip in there. Now it's a big mess. Can't change old dogs, can't change them. What is it they say? A leopard never changes his stripes. Mm -hmm. Yep, they don't change. I'm telling you, I've been there, done that for sure. But thankfully, since my mom passed away, that really changed my brother because his um, the person that bailed him out of every problem he was in was no longer around. And so he mm -hmm. had to force himself. Uh, this is a guy that never bought himself. He never, he didn't know what it was to buy himself underwear, deodorant, none of that. My mom did it all for him. And so, you know, when my mom passed away, he learned the hard way. Mom's not here to bail my butt out. And he did, I think he did about four years in jail um, after my mom got out. So he learned right there and then. I don't have anybody putting money in my account because I don't support um, convicts or anyone that's in jail. You, you landed in jail. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry they provide you with food. Um, three shelter, meals, medical, they get shelter, medical, edu even education. Yep. You don't need anything from the outside world. You manage to get yourself in there. You can manage to deal with the situation. That's how I feel. So, you know, my mom had the habit of always bailing him out. And when he landed in there, guess what? No mm -hmm. one was putting money in his account. Oh, well. Learn the hard way. Mm -hmm. so you want to make sure you get bubbles out. That's very important. So rub your fingers. The best thing oh, to look do. at that. Trisha said, so ladies, I went to the city to get my um, driver's license renewed. I had to sit in my car for two hours. Better in your car than in the DMV. Yes, absolutely. Wow. I'm surprised they were still open. I got to take my mother to get her new ID. So, young Sue, she's making us hungry with Brussels sprouts, stir fry, with lots of pepper, garlic, and some onion, soy sauce. What If, if you're not going to send us a plate, Young Sue. Yeah, Young Sue, you're being, you, you know, did you ever hear the story of sharing is caring or the, the saying sharing is caring? Okay, now we're going to put this. I'm going to try to um, probably bring it down a little bit here. Penny said, May, that is so funny. What's that? Whatever it was that you just said before. Sharing is caring? I guess. We're going to cover these because it's a little bit more uglier. No, no, let's do the front. Sharing is caring. It sure is. Isn't it sharing caring? Sharing is caring. I like Brussels sprouts. My kids doesn't like it, so we can't have it too often, but I do like um, I do like Brussels sprouts. My kids do not like Brussels sprouts. But it's a very good antioxidant. Brussels sprouts. Very, very good. All right, so 
And my my the best thing is instead of using a bone folder for something like this, use your fingers because you're it's a natural thing. And um, a God given tool that God has given us, right? To put lots of glue so it doesn't dry up. Young Sue is handing out. She's got all the emojis of coffee and looks like plates of food. I want some cake. I want some cake. I need. I'm gonna have to. You know, I have some um, carrot cake that I made. Um, and I froze in Idaho and Washington and Oregon. Oh my gosh. What about it? I guess it spread to Idaho, Washington, Oregon, and they all oh, that they just had an air. Uh, Patricia says earthquake, 6.5. Puerto, Puerto Rico one uh, had one also uh, this morning. This morning or yesterday morning? I forget. Where Patricia lives. What? It hit Idaho, Washington, and Oregon. Oh, my gosh. Out, get it out, get it out. Get the bubbles out. About an hour ago, she said it happened. Really? In Montana. That's where she is. Oh, God. Miss Miss Patricia, Eric had a funny joke for you. He wanted me to tell you. And, oh, my God. I forgot what it was, Miss Patricia. Had to do with one of your jokes that you, not, well, one of your stories. It wasn't a joke. It was a life story. <laughs> Miss Patricia and her life stories. And I can't remember what it was. He's like, he thought that um, somebody I was talking, I think he thought that Lourdes was you. And he's like, and I said, no, that's not, that's not Patricia. It's Lourdes. Um, guys, and you can probably cut these a lot better than me. You know, I'm just showing you guys and you guys can do, you can stamp on these. Um, I'm going to put some crackle on it, some transparent crackle, and then I'm going to seal it. Ooh. Oh, okay. What what uh Penny said before was she said what I said was I know May would get me out of jail. I know she would. I would. She'll, she'll do it in exchange for toilet paper. In exchange for toilet paper. Yes, because there's a shortage. That's that that's a uh, more value valuable than money right now. Oh. Uh, all right. So we're gonna put a, a code of Mod Podge, and this is a matte Mod Podge. And then I'm gonna take some transparent crackle from Stamperia. And we're gonna get some in the store. Chalice, Idaho, 6.3 earthquake. Wow. What the heck? Is that even a place for, you know where the place that I would hate for an earthquake or a volcano? Because you know that um, Yellowstone Park has the most deadliest um, inactive volcano. And that one was ever to erupt. OMG, we're all done. I have no clue why to toilet paper became, you know, everybody became. It became, it, toilet paper was invented in 1857. We learned something in this channel. Toilet no, paper. She, says she doesn't know why everybody went crazy over the toilet paper in the first place. I don't know, but it, we learned here on this channel. We learned on this channel. I don't know who, which of you guys read it. We learned <laughs> that it was invested, invested, in, invented in 1857. I, I remembered something, guys. <laughs> And I got a really, I got yeah. some kind of things in my brains. That I, I looked it up. Yeah, I had, I, we needed to know. Inquiring minds wanted to know. Yeah, do you guys know what Cucarachas says? If Yellowstone gets an earthquake, it will take out Montana, Idaho, Washington, down to California. I know. It's, yeah. it's, it's yeah. a deadly, it's a very deadly, deadly, bulk, I mean, volcano. Yeah, it's extremely de deadly. All right, naturally, you want this to dry up. I'm speed doing this because for the purpose of the video, of course, um, we're going to speed this up a little because I want to put the crackle. I want to see how it looks like with crackle. I'm just anxious. And you know, anxious people are impatient. 
Okay, Patricia says, guess what, girls? I had my sweetheart take me into the parking lot to see if Mich if Michael's was open, and it was there where it, and it was there where women walking out of the store. I was shocked. What do you mean? They're open? They're open? Oh my gosh. You live right down the epicenter, I know. I know, young Sue. I, that's why you 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 need to stay indoors. You really need. I know this is driving you batty because you're used to being so active. Okay. She says yes, they were open. She didn't go in. Oh, maybe they have, they don't have. Maybe the restrictions are are not as like everywhere else. But that's not an essential. I think everybody everywhere. No. Well, it is. It well. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We gotta. We gotta make. We gotta we clear something up. It is essential for us. <laughs> it is. Yes. <laughs> oh, Penny, you could, Penny says you can order and and they bring it out to you. But still, that means employee employees have to go in, and that's not an essential business. Well, it technically for us it is. For us it is, but. If they're open, then people are going to start questioning why aren't the liquor stores open? Why can't, why aren't? Well, I think, you know what? Liquor stores are open here in Texas because they consider that essential. Now they closed down the river because Eric went by, he drove by because, you know, he's anxious. And they, the river's closed, but the liquor stores, they keep it because they think that's an essential thing. Why? Because people are going stir crazy. These ladies were going inside. Oh my God. It, there's a supermarket here, the white supermarket, and they have a liquor section where you can go in. That's where I live, people, country. They go in and right there next to the to where the the, uh, the, the bakery is or whatever it is at the That's end of the store. That's where you need to get a hold of Buford and have him yeah. make you some moonshine. Yeah. <laughs> My husband worked at a winery. Oh, and they have him work at oh, because it's because because he's essential. Is he by himself? Like, does he have anybody um, standing next to him? Okay, so we got this. It's kind of you want to make sure it's not sticky. That's Rosa, right. the governor left a decision to the governors and state as to what the guidelines are. Yeah, each state has its own little guidelines. They close them over here. Yeah, they close the store the schools here till May fourth. All right, so we're going to use this Stamperia or stamp, Stamperia Mixed Media Crackle Paste. Now, this is transparent and means that we can mix this with any acrylic or any other color to give it um, a different look. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and because I'm just going to, wow. Go, go look at the, the message. What message? In private. You said Where? that. Where? Just now. I heard you say. I don't have any message from you. It's in the private. It's in the private chat in StreamYard. Oh. Did you know you real did you realize you said that? Stamp, stamperia, stamperia. Oh, stamperia. I'm like, oh. I'm stamperia. Like, I'm listening to, I'm hearing things. That is too funny. I'm losing my mind. Stamperia. Yeah, people aren't listening. They're just going out there, taking chances, not realizing that they're putting themselves and others at risk. They don't care. Mm -hmm. And this, they say that you should apply it with a spatula so you can get really good effects. So we're going to scrape this off because I don't like wasting products. Ooh, could you imagine a set of those? Or what? Of coasters? As coasters, yeah. I know. I don't know. Can you guys hear my child? 
No. God, you can. T you would think that there's a. Um, I mean, Gil's singing over here. Do you hear him? No, but I can hear my kid downstairs. Like, you know, I don't know. Let's go over her face. Let's see what she looks like with her face. We we can always test that out. It's it's always good to test things out, you know. Yeah, it's better to stay home. I don't know what my child is doing. What who she's beating downstairs? <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> that kid is something else. The thing she comes up with, guys. She sure keeps us busy. Like I'm 48 and I don't know where I have to keep them energy to keep up with her. The thing she comes up with, she's just something else. All right, we're gonna let this dry up. And then we're gonna spray it down. I'm not going to remove that little sealant because sometimes when you do that, it kind of dries the stuff up and I have a habit of not using everything all at once. Let's, let's, let's speed this up, guys, because y'all are probably getting anxious, anxious on me. Am I off camera? Uh, uh, yeah, a little bit. But that's okay because you're just drying. Mamma mia, somebody, I may. I had eight grandkids when I was your age. Oh my God, Miss, I don't have any grandkids because my child is being kind of um, selfish about that. I'm not going to mention any names, but her name is Carla K. Cortez. <laughs> <laughs> Patricia, he came um, home shortly after that, after the live, if I'm not mistaken. Who? Uh -huh. well, from the star. He came down from the heavens. Who did? Miguel last night. Remember he was at the start? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you guys see that crackle right there? Look, isn't that pretty cool? Yeah. I have six, Michelle. I have yeah. two girls and four boys. Look how pretty that is. We make really good coasters because, you know, once you seal it, now I'm going to put another coat of like that super thick high gloss varnish. Mm. Um, I had two coats of Mod Podge and then um, so far one coat of that super sealant high gloss thing. But basically, you want to make sure you seal it because if you don't, I'm confused. Where is this fixed piece being used on the box? Oh. She's doing that separate, hun. <laughs> Michelle, this is just an extra while that's drying. We're just working on some tiles and writing. You got two projects in one. <laughs> in one video. <laughs> oh, that's cute. <laughs> She's like, where are you putting this tile at, woman? <laughs> no. So you, you can see two for a twofer. Yeah, you got two for one. It's a two for one deal. So we're going to let this. It's kind of hard. I don't want to mess it up. Oh, yeah. Don't okay. feel dumb. No, you're not dumb. There's no he dumb question. He gave, us a, he gave us a giggle, and that's what we need. Yeah, absolutely. I'm going to use some of this rusty hinge stuff from Tim Holtz and I kind of like it but you know I also don't like the mess it makes see you weren't alone Patricia says no worries Michelle I was wondering that too <laughs> <laughs> you probably want what the heck is that crazy Puerto Rican woman doing with all that stuff <laughs> I mean I know she's creative but where is she going to put that huge piece <laughs> hi Evelyn that girl is really cray He's extremely cray-cray. 
Blot it. Blot it, blot it, mark it with a T. Ladies, if you haven't already, please show the hostess some love and click that thumbs up, share it on your page, tell your friends. Tell your friends, tell your friends. Her face showing up. Now on the other one, what I did is I took the vintage photos. Right there in it. You want to use your oldest ink pad. Don't use your new one. Mm. You want it kind of been down the gutter. Ooh, I like that. That's the one that you've beaten up, you know, the one that looks like seeing better days. That's the one you want. Evelyn May is um this is part two of the altered brush that she started this morning and it's drying right now so she's doing a quick little uh coaster on yeah. the side. Yeah, you guys got two in one video. Two in one. Patricia loves the brush and she ain't even finished yet, Patricia. Wait, just wait. <laughs> I like grungy. Y'all know I like grungy. I don't like anything that looks like it's brand new coming off of a factory line. Oof. Rose says it's looking fantabulous. I cannot. And then you can probably go grab an ink pad. And let's go grab one. I'm going to grab an ink pad and I'm going to stamp something on there. I don't like anything that looks like uh, it came out of a uh, assembly line. Uh, let's see. There you go, Michelle. Go get those dies out of the, the, I mean, the tiles out of the garage and make you some coasters. Yeah, make yourself some coasters. She says she's got a, she's got a box or something in the garage of it. Yeah, a box of tiles in her garage. Yeah, use napkins. If you got lots of napkins, you can use napkins. We're gonna use these. Let's get our um, stays on. Okay. Here, where's my stays on? I remember now. Where the stays on is. We'll use some stays on because it's permanent. These are Seth Efters. After Efters. Yeah, Michelle, if you got enough to do like a backsplash, imagine doing this technique on a bunch of tiles. Yes. Oh my God. I would love customizing your kitchen backsplash or even your bathroom backsplash. Just make sure you seal it really good. Yes. yes. Seal it. You know, you don't want to. Um, Thank you, Rose. You don't want to put it on something that it's not going to seal. Yeah. You no. Know? Let me use these little dots. I'm trying to look for a saying, so I've got to look for, get up and look for a saying or word or something. Let's see if I find a word. thought I had some, but I know I do. I know I do. I have some old, huge tiles. They're um, the 12 by 12 tiles that I actually bought a long time ago on eBay. And I wanted to put them in my kitchen and I never did it in my kitchen. But they were of Jesus and Mary, and I have them still. Definitely, Michelle. You pour resin on top of that and forget it. You're good to go. Yeah, if you pour resin on it, yeah. 
Definitely. It'll be safe for your backsplash for sure. Mm -hmm. There you go, girl. Run with it. Run with it. Trying to find some good words, guys. Give me a second. when you need a good, good word. Here we go. I need something with good scripts on it. Then you have it normally and then you can't find it. Okay, so we're going to use this primo mm. one. Less imperfection, more authenticity. Ooh, that's a good one. Isn't that a good one? Yeah. Let me get my sample off because I'm being lazy. Patricia's loving all the stuff on the paintbrush. Miss Patricia, I didn't know you liked uh, mixed media. Some people don't like the mixed media. They're all like, I'll do mixed media. They prefer if you didn't do mixed media. I don't have, you know, my only thing with mixed media is that I'm not one to like have my, hand, my hands dirty. But I just like likes it, but she's afraid to try it. Oh, you just let your hair down and just do it. That's the neat thing about mixed media is that you don't have to worry about anything. Rose, you're so funny. She goes, I switched to my regular iced tea. I feel better now. <laughs> You can you can you can rest now, right? He says I'll stop whining now. <laughs> what did you have? Unsweet tea now? Uh sweet tea now? What did she say? She, she said regular her her regular iced tea. I don't know what the her regular is. I think that's grungy enough for me. She says she loves mixed meat. Michelle says she loves mixed media because her house doesn't look like everyone else's. Yes, I like mixed media. I, well, I like I like my house to be grungy, in a sense. Not not. I like the sense of I don't like the sense of something that came out of a factory. Does that make sense? If it looks like it came from a factory, it just doesn't belong in my house. The, um, Evelyn's saying on the right side of where she's sitting, are those molds, the black and white pieces? Yeah, those are molds, right? Those are molds. Yeah. That mold's going to be available in the shop. That will be available. I'm going to try a little bit of this one to maybe, you know what? Hmm. Hmm. What did I do with that bowl, that other spray? Let's try this leather, this leather one from Stamperia. Get into that crack. I haven't heard that. She What's says, that? Um, Patricia says uh, she loves hot tea. Have you ladies heard that we are all supposed to be drinking hot things like tea and coffee and cocoa, etc., to keep mu mucus out of our lungs? Yeah, um, Young Sue told me that the other day because her niece is a um, pharmacist. We're going to go in with this uh, cracked pistachio here and there. Oh my God, I remember that, Michelle. She says, I don't remember the day when we all went to these home decor parties and we all had the same dead tree pick and the French blue dog. Yes. What? Let's see what the I mean. what? The, the blue duck. I had the blue duck set. I had the- My mom the had the blue ducks. Yeah, my mom had the, the blue ducks. Okay, Let's seal that up.
I'm guilty. I had the blue ducks. I love the blue ducks. Yeah, yeah my mom had those. My mom had those. She had blue ducks. She had chickens. Um, no, she had the blue ducks. Then she had the cow. She made me paint yes, her. Yes, with the blue, blue, the blue doll, uh, bows. Yes, the, yeah, the blue bow. Mm -hmm. Yep. I remember that. My mom had that. And the and she, tree with the pretty sunset. Yes. And then she had the um, the cow with the Amish kids. And then um, because we lived in like. Amish Central. They have a link to, to May's store, May and Carla's store. Tupperware parties, I remember those. Yeah, Tupperware parties. Um, you know, Tupperware has a lifetime guarantee. Mm -hmm. Hey, my mom still got a few of those pieces. Yeah, that's the best. That is the best ever, ever. Mm -hmm. um, the best ever. Oh, my God like this. I want to try this um, sherry. This is from Stamperi. I'm just going to go a little bit because it looks like it's really watered down stuff. Bring a little bit of red. Oh yeah. really watered down. Oh, you do, Patricia? She still has the little girl's plate dishes and some other things from the 70s. Yeah. Well, yeah. Things, that, that's a good product. I mean, What's that? it looks new. What's that? The Tupperware. Oh, yeah. And, you know, they have a lifetime guarantee. Yeah. So if it if it, something happens to it, they replace it. Mm -hmm. I'll be right back, ladies. Mm, I like this crackle. I like that. Okay, now we're going to seal it with some of that high gloss stuff. We're going to seal it with this. I'm going to pour some of this over here because I don't want to dip my brush in there. So it's on the tray next to me. You guys are not seeing the tray next to me, but it's on the tray next to me. It's over here. Let that sit and then we'll do another coat and then we're going to move on to the brush. It should be it should be to the point where I can go in there and add some rust. Some rusty, 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 crusty stuff. Is this Penny still here? Is she is she is she a little bit happier or is she still crying? I could definitely see this on a wall. I can, I can. She's still here. Okay, good. I'm right, gonna put some on this one, seal this one up. This is the second coat on this one. Now this one, we just did some um, vintage photos around the edges, straight with the ink pad. And we didn't do all the other stuff we did with the other one. I was just experimenting. Nothing wrong with experimenting. And you might want to experiment with some alcohol inks as well and see how that goes for you. I 
I use up what's on my palette here. Make sure you seal your edges as well because you don't want that to be like lifting up. Okay, all right. Got one little coat there. And let's see here. All right, we're going to let those babies dry up. We're going to move these over here to this side while they dry up. That one has more of the, the crackled. Ooh, see, this is not dried up. See that? That's not dried up. But we're going to move on and help, hope, hope, hope for the best. See, it's not dried. Hopefully, it'll dry up by the time we're done or by, t by tomorrow. By tomorrow. We're going to use some rust effect, and this is, you can make your own, and I said in the group, you can do this with some acrylic paint, some sand, and some glue, like Elmer's glue. You don't want to use, like, your expensive glue. You want to use your cheapest glue ever. Um, I'm going to go up to the rope. I do want a little fishy. Calling it a rope, but it's actually twine. You like the distressed look of the liquid on the brush. Thank you. And then I'm gonna get my me and my bottle, and let me get my alcohol ink. Water bottle, alcohol ink. I just want it to drip a little. You want it to drip a little, seep a little. Pray to God that this will not. I don't know. Excuse my singing, guys. Um, grab some areas. Doesn't have to be all the areas. Do you want to grab some areas? That one needs to be glued down. It's a hodgepodge there. Okay, I'm back. Sorry. Oh, thank you, Miss Michelle. Look at that. My fish doesn't want to stay. Why? I don't know. It doesn't like me. Crazy glue that sucker on. I mean, I'm about to put some hot glue on that sucker. I don't know why, because that was the last thing I glued. That was I glued this one last, and that one's sticking in there fine. I don't know why it's wanting to be a pain in the booty. Patricia says, "Clamp that baby on." All right. What the heck? Why aren't you staying? Why aren't you doing your job? Why are you giving me such a pain in the booty? Yeah, so for this, you just, if you don't have any rust effect or you don't want to go out and buy it because you don't think you're going to use a whole lot of it, what I suggest is that you go in and just make yourself some. And we had done a tutorial of this um, in 2017, I think it was. I don't remember when it was, guys how to do your own. Uh, 
and it, it make it look like it's rusty in certain areas, not all the areas, just certain areas. Where your normal rust may appear. What did you do? Oh, it wasn't you? What? It was the ghost next to you? Where? On the what? Do you mean after I cleaned and disinfected that you stained my counter? Get on his case. Get, get, get on clean that. that. Clean that up. You just saw me wipe I that down. So I don't give up here. Crap. Here go. Here, well, here you go. Oh, yeah. Go clean my counter. <laughs> He's on online school, so he can't clean. Is that what he is? His yeah, he came to get something to eat to go back, and, and that's his excuse for everything. Miguel, take out the garbage. I'm on online school. Miguel, I, I need you to, to help me in the kitchen. I, I'm on online school. <laughs> Yeah, I need a hug. <laughs> what did he say? He said, Miguel, I need a hug. I'm on the online school. You gotta get off, get off your computer. I'm doing a, I'm doing a live stream. I'm on my school. <laughs> How long is are they doing that, Miguel, for for you guys? What? The online? Till the end of the semester. So are they gonna give them money back? They stop. They just sent him an email today. They're discussing uh, about giving refunds for the uh, room and board. Talk about five. They, they haven't, you know, come to a finalization on that yet, but they are working on it. They should though. And the other colleges are this about how hard it is. Yeah. And, he, and they have to tell us when we can go back and get the rest of his things. Did he leave a lot of stuff over there? Yes. Uh, Jimmy and Timmy, the plant especially, <laughs> they better not die. I'll, I'll be doing oh, I'm sure those suckers are dead. <laughs> yeah, they're dead. Oh, thanks, Meg. They're, they're with Corona now. You are very welcome, Miguel. Yeah, I, just wanted that, to, um, I just wanted to let you know, I'm just going to damp it in so some of that rusty stuff comes down a little. So it runs, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, luckily, when I went to pick them up before the Easter break, um, he brought home his television and his Xbox. Otherwise, he'd be sitting here really dry. I, you'd have to bail me out of jail. <laughs> Those kids are something else. Did you see the 20, the kids that um, disobeyed their parents? And they went to Mexico, and 23 of them came back with uh, coronavirus. No, I didn't hear that. Yeah, during spring break, they decided that they were going to defy their parents. And they went in, and um, so it's a little bit wet, and it's a little runny. So with a little damp brush, go in there and just kind of help move some of that rust effect down. But, yeah, they decided to um, defy their parents against their parents' wishes. They went. 23 came, and 23 of those kids have now coronavirus. Oh, my God. Infecting everyone in their home. You know, it's like kids. No, that kids. means Mexico got it good. Mexico, I don't know if they have that many cases. It's just the, the ones that are trying to get in, you know? Mm hmm I think they had, like, 500 cases. Yeah, my little chart doesn't show them. It only shows me uh, the United States and Canada. That's it. How many are in Canada? Canada. Let's see. Where are you, Canada? Oh, Canada. Oh, Canada. Canada. <laughs> Confirmed 8,527. Recovered 1,592. Deaths 101. Well, not, that, not that many, not compared nope. to. The United States, 18,000, no, 189,053. Recovered, 7,082. Deaths, 3,906. It's crazy. Wow. 
Ah, he's coming apart. Wasn't glued down right. Come on, uh -oh. dude. Come on, dude. Don't do this to me. I probably needed to stay overnight, but we're going to work on him and then. Yeah, New Jersey, New Jersey comes in second and California third, Michigan fourth, and then Florida. It's crazy, crazy. Where you are, man, in Texas, it says 3,856 with 57 months. To live in the boonies. <laughs> Hi, Evelyn. Hi, Evelyn. You're probably a psych, but probably the first time in your life, Miss um, Patricia, that you're happy about living in the boonies, right? Okay, we're going to use some vintage photos, or not vintage, but teak oh, one, alcohol ink. We'll I was telling May, God got me out of New York quick. He knew this was coming. Yeah, we're going to go into the rope areas, and we're going to make it even more, and then we're going to go ahead and spray it again. Oops, sorry, my camera. I got to move this camera this week, sometime this week. After tonight, I got to do schoolwork. So no, no, probably no lives tomorrow. 52 years, Patricia, and where you live? Wow. This is to make it even make the the twine a little bit more old and rusty, like that rust is kind of crudded down on it. Michelle says, "I love my hill in Timbuktu. I love having no neighbors now." LOL. <laughs> uh, I think everyone that doesn't have neighbors are saying yeah. the same thing. I grew up in little slower, lower Delaware. Oh, wow. You got your first confirmation yesterday, Rose, in your county. The we first, only had one in my county also. We had, we had a couple here, and we had um, one death, one 40-some-year-old. One I think he left behind six kids. Oh, my goodness. Yet the mayor didn't want to shut down our town. That's the part that was making everyone really even more angry. That he didn't want to shut down. Okay. That's good. We're gonna let that sit and dry up a little. I'm gonna probably heat the get the heat gun on it. A little it's wet and this fish does not want to dry up It'll stay up very darn it and you're using the fabric for that no that's the gel medium oh. Not quite done, guys. Not quite done. We're just having a little bit different. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> the the um, um, synthetic hair. Yeah, it melted like. Yeah. Hey, but that gave it. I think that looked cute, though. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I thought that was pretty cool. have to work around some of this and then let it sit um, but I like that the way that crinkled up it like it got a perm looks like you know, you know what it looks like it's, it looks like one of those fly fishes that Eric uses all the time mm. that's what it looks like all right let's get we're gonna go with this little guy here it's ocean green And that's Master's Touch from Hobby Lobby. Dry crate, a 
Make sure you have a dry paintbrush, paper towel, to Oh wow, it's like coming to life with all the details. Hold on to the fish. Yeah. Don't, brush them, don't brush them off. <laughs> fish is just not liking me today. Why don't you just use the glue gun? Mm -hmm. That at least a dot so it holds it in place until the, the other stuff dries. I just don't trust the hot the glue gun and find like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's uh, Patricia saying uh, there's something about that teal that pops. It's because it's going in all the little nooks and crannies of the details of that of, of the pieces. So it's mm -hmm. really popping against the, the dark color. One thing I do have to say is, um, even though that, that is a, what do you call it, a gel medium from Hobby Lobby, it's a lot cheaper. See, I don't want to stand on it. Oh, that fish is not cooperating. I don't think he wants to make the cut. Um, you know, look, I even put... He just does not like it. Replace it with a giant black pearl. If it doesn't want to cooperate. Check the cantando ese. Gasolina. The gasolina. All right, let me clean this up. Let's clean up some of the gook on him. Maybe if we clean up the gook. And... The gas went down again over here. It's down to a dollar ninety nine. Yeah, they're saying it's going to go down to possibly ninety nine cents because I forgot what two countries are fighting, Miguel. I don't remember. There's countries fighting. What are they not fighting? About yeah, there's two countries fighting about the oil or whatever, and it was probably the Middle Middle East. Yeah. I, I don't remember. Europe? I don't know. I haven't. I haven't listened to social studies in a while. P.O. Trump was talking about it today. I didn't pay too much attention. P.O. Trump. Tú sabes cómo es este loco. Le vas a decir P.O. Trump y él se va a poner ya tú sabes cómo. He's not my tío. He's my papi. Papi Trump. He's papi Trump. I'm online school. What? He's on my school, Dios mío. He goes, scratch my back. I'm on my life school. <laughs> this is my life. He is milking it big time, man. Up, 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 up. up. All right. Duro, duro. Ah. Okay, okay, go. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh, that. Maybe I will go eat meat again. You can become famous. Who's going to be famous? You. He's liking your art. That, wait, that's a brush. Oh, my gosh. That's so cool. Oh, I have the I have the one she gave me in the other room. This is an original. Uh, that's an original too. She made it. Nah, this one's hers. You, yours is just for you. That's awesome. And she made. All I made it. She, she got it. She I made it. You made it for me. <laughs> you guys say you don't like it. I heard that. No, oh. I said it's in storage, probably. It's right there, <laughs> hanging. Where? <laughs> oh my God! I'll find it. Put it on camera. Put it on camera so they can see that one. Do you have it? It's on the. It's on the. Wait a minute. Oh, 
This kid is hilarious, guys. This kid, her kid is just something else. I wish she would craft because I would bring them on videos to craft with us. Okay. Now I gotta build the key back on. I'm gonna kill this child. Yeah, I love you. You knocked off the key. <laughs> what did he say? He says, Remember, I'm the one that's not gonna take you to the nursing home. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love him. Oh. I love his sense of humor. Yeah. All kids should be like him. He is so funny. Hi, Ev I got two Evelyns on. I got Evelyn Mendez and Evelyn, Evelyn Rivera. Yeah. Hello. I don't want to mess with this because I like the rustiness of the rope. So we're not going to mess with that because we love that rustiness. Oh, that was too much right there. Yeah, we're like brother and sister. We're growing up together. I don't know who's the mommy. Who's the daddy? Who's who's your dad? Wait a minute. Tell Miguel, come here. <laughs> Miguel. Who's, who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? Don't get him started. <laughs> yeah. Never mind, never mind. No, she wants to know who your daddy is. Who's your daddy? <laughs> She wants to know who's your daddy. Who's my daddy? <laughs> uh, who's your, who's your daddy? I mean, the only dad I have that I consider a dad is is, is God. So you know, Red Cross blue shield to him. <laughs> Red Cross blue shield to him. Yeah, that's uh Madea. When she doesn't sign on the cross, she doesn't say Father, Son, Holy Ghost. She says Red the name Cross of the blue. Father, the Son, the Blue Cross, Blue Shield. <laughs> <laughs> I have a father. It's God. He's provided me so far. Yep. There you my go. earth god just got tired of me. There you go. The dog is mommy. No, I'm not mommy. I mean, the dog is not mommy. I'm mommy. Oh, yes, he is. Oscar's your mother? Yeah. He's there for me. No <laughs> Oh, Lord. <laughs> he's he's his service dog. Show up. Do you have the paintbrush there? Yes, I do. Hold on. He knocked off the, the, the what do you call it? I got to glue, glue, glue it back on the um, the um, key. Do you see? Well, it's all, hold on. It's an old paintbrush, guys. This is an old paintbrush. And the key's supposed to go here, but when you're looking for the paint in the hoo ha. And be brave. Look at that. Everybody. Uh, Same thing. Same thing that she's doing now. We're going to go in with some uh, fossilized amber. Yes, it is. Okay, put yourself back on full screen, May. Oh, I'm sorry. Thought I was. Uh oh. Uh, uh, hold. Don't put it on full screen. Patricia, Patricia wants to see my son. Hold on. Let me get him. Miguel Angel. Miguel Angel. He's sitting back there. You don't hear me. Miguel Angel. Come here, the ladies want to take a look at you. Come here, the ladies want to see you. What do you mean, what ladies? Who do you think I'm talking to? <laughs> the life. Oh. <laughs> Come on. All right, hold on. Okay. 
You got to, he's got to look good, ladies. He has to brush his hair now. Hold on, <laughs> I'm telling you guys, this kid is something else. He is something else. He's going to look like where's Waldo. Done. I'm going to school right now. What? All right. Here's the camera over here, Knucklehead. Wait, do I have to? Hi. Let <laughs> me go. He looks just like you. But prettier. <laughs> <laughs> he is too funny. He is very funny. Yes. He needs to have a show. That's what he needs to do. No, I'm good. Famous people don't have lives. <laughs> Famous people don't have lives. His name is Miguel Patricia. <laughs> Hello, Lulu's son. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he is. Patricia says he's handsome. He's very handsome. It usually takes me an hour to look this pretty. Yes. What did he say? What did he say? It takes him an hour to look that pretty. And it smells. Sometimes he put... So he put so much cologne on it because I know he's coming from the other side of the apartment. But it's not good. Oh, Michelle is calling you out. She says, hello, handsome young man. Now tell your mama sorry. <laughs> Ask why she wanted you. I'll say sorry if she if she if she if she gives me a kiss. I'll give you a kiss. But you gotta say sorry first. Oh, <laughs> he's, he's nineteen. She no, has a beautiful. She has a beautiful granddaughter. Patricia's fixing you up with her granddaughter. No, 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 no. I don't do. I don't do online dating. Okay. <laughs> I learned my lesson on that. I got. I got. I got. Nope. I got caught when I was little. Did you get catfished? Um. Yes, I did. No way. It was, yeah. I learned my lesson. Mom yelled at me for it. <laughs> oh, she's an older woman. She's 20. <laughs> Does she got money? No. <laughs> Listen to him. Older Listen. women? People are going people are gonna to say, how the hell is she raising her son? <laughs> With love. <laughs> and no money. I guess that's why he is asking for women. And <laughs> no money. Wait, and no money? You know what? That's okay. I don't, money's, money doesn't equal happiness. It's the, little, it's the little things. Like yep. this pop tart. <laughs> pop tart. It buys you pop tart, and as long as they buy you pop tart, you're happy. Well, no, it was like an example. I'm oh, okay. small things. I'll live in a box and I'll be happy. She's a junior at college. What's she studying, Patricia? Oh yeah, what is she studying? Did you finish all your assignments? Maybe. Okay. You're the one that brought me here. I'm sorry. Oh no. <laughs> But you guys like his attitude. I love his attitude. He has the most beautiful attitude and personality. Yes, he does. I can't see. I don't have my glasses. I don't hey, I lived in the tent, Miguel. Okay, but like that's see, but you you had like a roof over your head. That's good. You were still protected. She is going to be a dentist. I'll marry her. Wait, a dentist? Need, yeah, she's going to be a dentist. That's a lot of school. I mean, that's a lot of school. Wow. There you go, Miguel. No, that's a lot of schooling. She's going to, but it's going to be worth it. Yep. You have a beautiful smile always. I try. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. All right, All right now. All right. One, All right, put the camera on you. Put the camera on you, May. Because there you go. I can go now. Yes, you can go now. All right, you goodbye. can go now, Miguel. Thank you for being a good sport. Of course. Buy her stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. All right, we're gonna use some Joker's paste. This is bronze. This is what we were talking about, Miss um, Michelle Wax. And basically, that's this kind of brings out. It helps accent the colors a little bit and that. prima has beautiful waxes and um i don't have those right now i ordered some um some waxes from prima i have one color from prima and that's that's it so we're gonna go in with the gold let me 
put my brush back because I'll knock it down because I'm not used to it sitting next to me. And you can use you can use your fingers or you can use a brush. I prefer finger because it's you know again it's a natural tool that God has given us. So why not? Why not my not? Rose uh Patricia says so pretty. Rose says looking so pretty. I need some waxes when you get them. I've never used them. I did not order waxes for the store, um, but I could place an order for those um, because I didn't get, like, I want to get some of the Prima waxes um, because I love their waxes. Oh, this one kind of fell out. The heck. This, um, so here's what I was saying about um, sometimes cheap is not the best. Like this um, gel medium, I'm noticing it takes hours to dry hours upon dry hours and it's not like your prima so on the downside of that that is that uh, it's cheaper but it takes longer to dry up so i did order some um, um i did order from stamperia uh a new type of glue and I'm hoping that when it comes in we'll try it try and see because you all know I gotta keep testing these glues until I'm comfortable with the glue that I feel that it's right for me so what do you want go dog go with me go do you have to go out again come on go to the door I love working with these. Um, I used to have all the, used to have all the Prima colors, but they've come out with some new ones now. My dog is like an old man or a baby because he goes to the bathroom like every 20 minutes. No, like Nani, Nani, we used to call her Miss Nani pees a lot. Oh. Every time we went on a road trip, we had to stop like every five miles. I gotta go pee. I gotta go potty. So her name, her nickname is Nani pees a lot. You guys are welcome to say that to her. You guys are like family. I'm sure she will be okay with that. <laughs> or Nani Stinky Bottoms. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. We're having such a horrible time. We're going to have to... Definitely get some Prima modeling, Prima mediums, sorry, because it's not doing its job, guys. I like the way these bristles stood up. You know why I like it? Because it reminds me of my husband's fly fishing. I'm sorry, I had to get me another coffee. Mm -hmm. I went into the kitchen to let the dog out the back. I figured you guys will get a cup. You're not even listening to me. I said I want some coffee. Did you oh, order I'll, the I'll send it through the screen. Wait a minute, did you order the glue gel? I ordered um the deco, the 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 um the heavy, I think it's a heavy glue, and I also ordered the the um what do you call that darn thing? Decoupage glue. Because you know we've been doing a lot of 3D and Young Sue is doing Young Sue is one of my favorite students. You know why? Because she's always and I saw that Tina Adams, she posted in the group her box, and I'm so happy. But Young Sue is always doing every project that I make. She's always doing it. She's on it. She's on it, lady. She's on it and she shares it. Mm 
that's the, that's what we want everybody to share. Look at that. Look at that, ladies. It's like putting every little, every little spot. Yeah, close that. <sighs> I don't want to say it es explicitly, but things are working nicely on my end. I'm not being tossed out. <laughs> That's a good thing. Yeah, that's a good thing. I think it was Miguel kicking you out. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. He's he's on now and it's not doing it. What Man. kind of internet do you have? Ooh, yeah. Look at that, guys. I don't know about y'all, but I am in love. Yes. I like you guys know that project from five years ago. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, Miss Evelyn. That just means you're a busy school teacher with two taught. You got two little kids. She's got her, she's raising her grandkids. Wow. Did you see them in the treehouse? It looks like a little house from Puerto Rico. Yes, it's so cute. I saw Isn't it. Isn't cute? I love her little treehouse. I just love it. But she just says, gorgeous. Evelyn loves it. Penny, what did she say? Some, some towns are locking you up for going out while on the other hand, they're releasing criminals and prisoners. Yep. That's yeah. what I'm surprised that's uh, that in the jails and stuff like that, that maybe because they are enclosed, but that it hasn't broken out big in in all the correctional. Well, because it's enclosed. I'm surprised it's in, that they're getting it because the only one that's bringing it in are the uh, uh, correction officers. Yeah. They're the one because there's those people aren't out. So who's bringing it in? The correction officers. Yeah. And I'm guessing through the mail. That's what they tell you to just, you know, not to open up your mail right away, to spray it. I don't know. I don't know if it's the mail or what it is, but I have yet to have a bottle of Lysol. It is nowhere to be found. It's like an extinct species over here. And no hand sanitizer. Every time I go out, I go out to search for, you know, I look for that stuff. Nope. I was lucky I thought I was able to find the two bars of soap with the with the uh disinfectant in that said 99%, blah, blah, blah. Uh-oh, Evelyn says, unfortunately, I don't remember how you did them, so I'll just have to improvise. Yeah, let those creative juices flow. I don't know which kits they were. Um, I don't know if, I, if they were live kit. If I did them live, they're not ex non-existent. Um, it, it's gonna, yeah. If, if they go out every day and then they go back in, and if they catch it, that's gonna be like, forget it. Yeah, we're gonna have to let that suffer. We're gonna have to do something about that little, that little sucker there. It's supposed to help the vodka, you know, mixing it up with whatever. You know what? I just keep everything clean. I got my bleach. It's only me and Miguel and the dog here. Nobody comes. I'm the only one that basically goes out to do the runs, and I make sure they're quick and stay away from people. Yeah, I got that. The vin I got that. I got. I use the bleach. I got the vinegar. And I got baking soda. 
I wipe the counters down with um, bleach wipes and stuff like that. I can't even find that here. I gotta make my own. Well, that's because we got it towards the beginning. Yeah. But we got bleach and when I'm done with the wipes and from what I hear from what I hear, we're not getting it because New York is getting it all. Because, because it's out of control over there. Yeah, probably. But everybody's good over here. People stay away. They mark the floors at Walmart for all the yeah, Eric stuff. said Eric said that because only one of us is going out. Um Eric said that when he went to the grocery store, they have like little shields. You can't. Yeah, they have like over here, they have blue squares. Please, you know, practice whatever distancing six feet apart, blah, blah, blah. And they tell you, don't pass this square. Yeah. Well, here they have a shield um, to protect our cashiers. But, you know, yeah, and some of them, yeah, in, in the, not in Walmart, but in, in uh, other supermarket, they have a shield in front of a couple of the registers. But it doesn't make sense because they're not wearing gloves and they're hand Oh no, here they have gloves and they spray Eric said they sprayed it sprayed. They had gloves. They they they're they're uh, they're doing all kinds of precautions in the in the grocery store, not Walmart, the local grocery store. Yeah, yeah, the other uh the other store. Yeah, the little um we have a store called H E B and actually Arnold Schwarzenegger just applauded H E B because of their um for everything they're doing, not only as far as the virus, but also because of the way they're taking action as far as um, precautions with their employees and everything. Um, Evelyn says it was the dress form, the tussie musty, the lace book, the clutch purse, the fairy box and album, and I'm now working on the tag book kit. Woof. Oh shoot, man. Okay, so the Tussie Massey, that's an easy fix. We can we can we can we can do that. I don't know if I have I might have the tutorial um of an older Tussie Massey kit. The Angel Kit, I do know there's a video. I have to get Eric to turn on that computer because I know I saw that video oh, several months ago. I went my, remember I told you man, my mom took my stuff and gave it to my daughter to take out of the house. I was like flipping. Uh -huh. I was looking for my tower computer where my daughter found it in her basement oh where there is no heat control or anything like that. So now I have a heater, space heater facing it, hoping that if there's any moisture that it'll dry and it didn't harm my tower computer so I can put that in the other room. Put what in the other room? In, in my where I have the craft area to put my tower computer in there. Oh, so oh, gotcha. I got a computer over there instead of this laptop with this contraption setup that I got over here. Oh, gotcha. So mm -hmm. I'm trying, I'm praying that the space heater, you know, I have it a nice distance, but that some air gets, some warmth gets around it. So if there's any moisture inside, I took the, the cover off. You know, certain little areas here that obviously do not want to stick. So we're having a little bit of gluing issues but a lot has to do because joyce, hello joyce did you were your ears ringing we were asking about you before she did the fairy box okay i did the fairy box who did the fairy box young sue said she finished the fairy box two years ago i'm trying to think there should be a, I, I, i'm trying to think where that video would be I know that I know the dress form. I have a kit, a tussy mussy, I believe. I believe um, that there is a video on that. Young Sue reminded me. There's a tussy mussy. I think I put the tussy mussy video in in here in my in this new. Look at the videos here. I believe it's in there. Let me see. Let me see if I can find it. The tussy mussy. Yeah, I believe so. Yes, I believe I, I brought Ooh. back a tussy mussy one. Hmm, let's see. Yep, I believe so. Hold on, hold on. And we're going to go in there. It's the same concept. Um, Evelyn, I think 
if you look at it, I believe, I believe so. It's the same concept because I always put wings on my tussy mussies and there's a reason why I put wings on it because of my mom being an angel. Okay, I found one. How to make a shabby chic tussy mussy nine months ago. Yep, it's that's an old video and it's the duplicate one. Um, the fairy tale, the fairy box. Gosh, I don't think that one really exists. I think we did that one live. Okay, there's the Tussie Mussy link. So you can do the Tussie Mussy. Let's go with a little bit more. I'm going to brush in just a tad bit more of this one. Bring out, and it's got to be a dry brush, guys. Dry brush. Dry brush. Dry brush. Let me see, what else did she have? And this is the for, ocean. I'm ring. looking for the purses now to see what you have up. The purses? What was, what, which one was it? Again, she said that the... She said, hold on, let me go back. Uh, ba -ba, it was dress form, tussy mussy, lace book, clutch purse. Pro, okay, the clutch purse. Um, I That one's easy. I can redo that one. Okay, what she has up here with regards to purses, she has Tonic Studio Peony Bloom handbag, Christmas gift bag, and card tag set. Then she has how to make a sachet bag, uh, no sew fabric scrap flowers. That's another video. How to make ivory shabby chic satin flowers. Nope, doesn't come nothing up with the purses. No, it's not there. No, no, this the clutch bag. Um, I know how to make that. In fact, we can we can schedule. Um, it's not going to have the same stuff you have because that was a kit, but I can um, pretty much. Well, Sue is asking, does anyone have the fairy box? I have the instructions on my Photoshop. Cool. The fairy box. Evelyn just said she has that because I don't think that video exists anymore. I, I, I'm sorry. Eric took down those videos. What do you do with them? He closed down my YouTube account because of everything that was happening. And it, yeah, but he didn't save the, the videos? Mm -mm, he just shut down. Oh. The he went he went rogue in there. Yeah. It was a bad day. It was a bad day. Lightly. Go in lightly, guys. Don't want to go in there heavy handed. It's like light like a feather. Come back here. Look at that. It went from totally black to this. Wow. No, the fairy box video doesn't exist. No, I don't. Yeah, Eric, I think he, that's one of the videos. He, that's That was a live, I believe, and he, yeah, he took all that down. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Hard times in my life. Probably, probably for the best that I don't see it because it, it was, those were hard times in my life. Evelyn says the dress form is a video I would love to see again because you did so much with it. Um, yeah, the dress form, I know for a fact that that video, I saw it a couple months ago. I just got to get him to turn that computer because that computer kind of died out on us. Not died, but um, uh, what do you call it? How can I say? It's having problems. Um, there's a yeah, there's something in it that gives it a glitch. A it has a virus too. No, not a virus. It's got a glitch on it. You know what you can get me? Get the cable. Get and the cable. I getting it fixed, um, and the guy here fixed it. I think the computer guy here sucks. That's just the problem. The computer guy here really does suck. Turn it 
trying to make it look like patina. Like it's been in a sunken ship somewhere, you know? Evelyn says, don't worry. Don't be sorry. We are building new happy memories. Yes. But we can we can always figure out how to recreate a lot of these videos. Bring in. Um, I do have a dress form here, but it's just it's not that big tall one you had because you guys got you guys got a massive kit with that one. That was a massive kit. Okay, guys, here it is with all its beautiful glory. Yes. Look at that! Look at all the details. Oof. Ooh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. All the glorious details. Look at this. Hi, Donna's. You came just in time. Hey, Donna's. Look at what she just finished. Look at that. And you can still see the Mod Podge on the handle of the rice paper. And it is just absolutely stunning. Let me see. I see a little spot that needs a little bit of. Michelle loves it. Patricia says, everything you touch turns out gorgeous. Donna says, beautiful. Oh, thanks, you guys. You guys are so sweet. It's really sweet of you guys. Absolutely gorgeous, says Evelyn. Yes. If you love it and you know it, hit thumbs up. If you love it and you know it, hit thumbs up. If you love it and you know it and you really want to show it, if you love it and you know it, hit thumbs up. There you go. There we go. There you go, guys. It is absolutely, I think I love this. this is my favorite. This is absolutely my favorite, favorite paintbrush of all favorite, time. Favorite is. Favorite is. <laughs> the favorite is, favorite is of all paintbrushes um, of all times. I honestly, honestly, Love this. Bravo. That is None of us are surprised, right, everybody? We didn't expect anything less than gorgeous. Wow. And then we flip it this way, and I love the rusty look of how we did the rust effect. Again, if you want to make your rust effect, for this color here, you're going to need a little bit of red. Um, a little bit, you're going to mix a little bit of um, black, a little bit of brown, a little bit of yellow, just not too much. You've got to do a little bit dots and then just until you get that nice rusty look. Sand and some Elmer's glue, the cheapest glue you can find. And um, because the Elmer's glue is what keeps it adhered. Oh, Douglas was working on an ocean blue book. You know, you got to oh, share that in the group. Yeah. Don't tease us like that. Don't say, look what I'm, I'm doing this and then not show us. <laughs> I love this. So Donna said you did great work. Thank you. And so then this is just an added bonus. And look, it's already dried. It's totally sealed. Isn't that pretty? May so talented, says Evelyn. No. No, you guys are all talented. And then this one has the crackle. You can't really see, but you know what? I'm thinking the crackle will pop up with a little bit of this bronze. There she goes. She's not finished. Look at that. Because we still have to seal it, remember? we got to do that second seal. Oh, that's right. I'm going to go in with a little bit of this green yeah. and dry brush some of this green.
give it a nice little patina look almost. All right, so I think Evelyn made the decision for us for our next project is going to be a clutch. Ooh. It'll be a clutch. Evelyn says, I absolutely love blue on anything. I do too. It's my favorite color. At least this blue, this ocean green from... Um, Evelyn says, yay! A clutch on the set of like a handbag. I'm going, to show you, I'm going to show you what I'm going to use. I'm going to use a placemat from Hobby Lobby. Yes. You guys can't use it. Is that what you have in your kit, um, Evelyn? It's probably what you have in your kit. Go around the house, grab your placemats, start an assembly line. <laughs> um, Patricia's asking, are you going to put the felt on the back of that? I'm sure she is, otherwise it'll scratch her table. Scratch your table, yeah. It'll scratch the table. The table. But I still have to seal this here because I don't want anything to leak into that. Oh, she has to pull it out of the vault. She has to pull it out of the vault. <laughs> Hi, honey, Bea. I didn't see you come in. Hey, Pam. Evelyn's excited. Go get, go to the vault and get it. We're going to go in with a little bit of the gesso. And I'm just going to bring in the corners. Honey, Bea was sneaky. Yes, you were. I mean, you just popped up. And I'm like, wait, where'd she come from? Are you staying safe, um, Pam? You guys, poor, you know, I feel bad for you guys. You guys went from having horrible fires yeah. to now this. I mean, gosh, what more can happen, right? Boy, don't even say that. Gosh. It says the vault that protects all my kids. Who said that? Evelyn? Yeah, Honeybee says, yes, I'm, I am, haven't left the house for weeks. I don't think, no, don't go anywhere. Yeah, don't go anywhere. No, Michelle, it's a cloth pit, uh, placemat, not paper. Yeah, cloth. Cool. I'll show you in a minute, Miss Michelle. Floods, fires, drought, we've had it all. Mm-hmm. Oh, no. Well, bad for you guys. You guys have had a lot. You guys need a break from all this. You're welcome, Michelle. This one probably is not my favorite. Because of that crack. I'm not sure about that crackle. Honeybee says, we're bread tough. I'm never going to remember her name because I like her, her YouTube channel name. You're never going to be. You, you have a hard time remembering people's name, period, yeah. Lourdes. Yes. I, t I said it yesterday. I said, sometimes when I go to call Miguel, I end up, you know, yelling the dog's name. You call him by the dog? Yeah. Oh my God. Because I'm always yelling at one of them. You heard him? What are you saying? You got that right. <laughs> oh. No, when I had all three of them in the house, oh, Maron. I used to go nuts. I, I used to go down the list. And then as they got older and the grandchildren started coming, I'd have, I'd have to really think who, whose name I needed to call out. Yeah. Who's who, huh? Yeah. Evelyn says, no one is allowed to touch them. I haven't even allowed myself to pull anything out for other projects. <laughs> she respects the vault. 
She respects a vault. That's funny. You guys are too funny. Michelle says she did stock up on candles already, so I'm ready for power cuts in the summer. Oh, my goodness. You guys get power cuts, too? Oh, my God. You, you, see, it's not only me. Rose says the same thing. Like she still goes down the list when they're all at home. Yes. When we're That's having family gatherings, forget it. Michelle says California too. Mm -hmm. Michelle, did you get a voice message from me today? <laughs> I was, I was like so concerned about um, her. Um, oops, sorry guys. Evelyn yeah. says now you could really see the crackle. I love it. She says. Yeah, I'm not sure that's my favorite. To be honest, I'm not sure, and it's probably because it didn't have any. I'm not. Not, I'm not, you know, you know, sometimes there's something that you don't really care for. We're, she says, we're heading into winter in June, says Honeybee. I've had to leave my home from, from fires, Michelle says. Wow. Hot chocolate people, yummy. That's Rose. Yeah. I saw the, she says, Michelle says, I saw the call, but now... I added you with a name with a name, so I will answer. <laughs> she ignored because she didn't know it was you. I do the same thing. If I don't see your name, mm -mm. I was like, okay, I gotta call her and let her know. She's gonna get um, bigger box legs. All right, I'm not sure if that's my favorite. I don't think it's my favorite it's not that it's ugly i think it's just not particularly my favorite i like this one because i'm more into the industrial kind of look and this one i love Evelyn I got, said, well if you, it, you can send it to her way because if you don't like it <laughs> well i'm just it's just i think it's the uh crackle in it it's just I, i'm not i'm not digging i like the industrial look so this here is my favorite and i am going to be doing more with the other little tiles that i have um this one here not so much not at all because of the crackle and trust me i love crackle i'm just not digging the crackle on the tile itself so and maybe it was her image it's just no no i don't know i don't know mm. you know sometimes you like something sometimes you don't like it and we don't have to like everything we make and i just don't like it <laughs> Yeah, we, uh, me too, Donna. So we, a lot of calls from our friend Scam Likely. Yes. And now those calls are going out. People trying to scam people out of their uh, stimulus check saying, we got your check. Give us your info so we can deposit it. Yeah. yeah. It really me off because that the, a lot of, of the elderly fall for that that aren't too savvy. You've been sewing a lot of quilt tops but haven't seen haven't even put a dent in my material stash. Oh my God, I can imagine. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you, Miss Michelle. Uh, my brush is different. What, how is your brush? What did you do with your brush? Were you following along with us? So the mold's gonna be in a store. That'll be in the store. We're also gonna be having the um, these sprays from um we'll have some some of these in the store we'll have this color in the store we'll have this color in the store so we'll have some color in the store and some sprays that's going to be in the store um, these says, are yes but i didn't have all the things you had doesn't matter it matters post a picture. You, yeah post a picture whatever you have it's just whatever you have we don't all have the same things we don't all have the same stuff, so whatever you have. She says, so I use Christmas decorations that were ocean. Cool. There you go. There you go. And that'll work. That'll work just as great. We all have different things at home, so that's why I said pull out what you have. All right, so let me go show you guys. Let me wipe my hands. I'm going to go wash my hands because I don't want to pick up that thing. Show you guys. Uh, 
Yeah, it doesn't have to be the gimmick. That thing. It's the theory, you know? Everybody's brush is different. So everybody go find your placemats for, for the next class. We bought your trims and your laces. Oh, uh, well, try using it with regular paint. You can't. What's that? Um, Honeybee says, I can't use any of those mediums because of her allergies. I said, what about regular paint? Oh, yeah, you can use acrylic paint. Yeah, or even chalk paint, right? Will it work? Yeah, on chalk paint, paint, milk paint, mm -hmm. chalk paint, milk paint, watercolor paint. You know, it's all the same thing as long as it's flowing. You can use it all. Oh, she she, she her her brush is two inches. I don't care. I want to see it. Evelyn says I'm looking for the combination to the vault now. Yes, go and go. Open that vault. Get a stick of dynamite. You guys are crazy. Oh shit. You guys are nuts. Crazy loca, loca. All of you guys are loca. Evelyn says, finally, lace. She wants to see you do lace. All right, let's see. You don't have any paint, or you can't use paint either? I believe this is the one you have. I believe, I believe. Put a glass top on this desk because I get paranoid about. Oh, that. you can't use paint either. Oh boy. What do you mean? Allergic to it? Allergic to it? She says no. That's not, she. It's a solid. A solid. What? It's a solid one. She's going to go look now, says Oh, I know which one she's talking about. Oh, yeah. It's the same thing. We're going to have, we'll end up covering this anyway. Mm. It'll, it'll be the same concept. She's going to break open the vault now. <laughs> the reason is because I had a, that, a clutch kit in 2016 that had this one, but it was in black, and uh, I had two colors, black. It was a black one, and then we had the ivory one, and then um, Patricia. I'm just restarting all over with crafting. And yeah, I don't have any craft supplies. I don't do videos. Um, I don't do anything like May does. No, I don't do that. Yes, I'm more of a paper girl. You, but you do, you do good, and you have great ideas. You just don't have any craft supplies. Well, I mean, it's, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm slowly putting that my area together. I got my chair, I got my table, and I got a, my little toy, and I got some stuff. I'm gonna get there now. I just gotta make sure. I thought I was gonna be able to like start going in there today and with the computer, but now I gotta dry that sucker out. Make sure I don't get electrocuted when I plug it in. Okay. Let me clean this up and I want to show you guys because y'all know I get flustered if I see a mess all around me. When was the last time I crafted me? When, when I did my little folios, what was that? Was that last year? My, my little folios? When you last crafted. Yeah. It was about a year ago I did some folios. Oh, you did something for Christmas. I well, did. I guess that was yeah, you said you did something for the kids, some ornaments or something. Oh, the oh, that was the year before. Yeah, the Christmas ornaments. And then then the, year, this, the this, this, this year, not last the year before. No, it was the year before. This year, I did the memorial Christmas ornament for my daughter's for um, your daughter's baby. Mm -hmm. That was all I could do, going crazy. Okay, hold on, guys. We're cleaning up here, and then. Evelyn um, said yes, it was a denim looking placemat. 
Yep, um, you had the solid one. So that was the last, the very last, one of the last ones I put out. As far as, that was the last clutch kit that I had put out, I mean. Okay, so let's clean this up and then we're gonna show you. So we're not getting. These rice papers are great for all kinds of stuff. I mean, they're wonderful. My Podge, decoupage. They're great. Okay. Um, Evelyn's asking, May, did you have a canvas bag kit too? I found one in my vault. <laughs> a canvas bag? Um, no, shot. put everything in there. Nope, Shadi did. Oh, Shadi did. Oh, okay. Shadi had it. Shadi had it when she bought um when she bought creative detail, she put out a a tote bag. Oh. Mm -hmm. Wow, you really got some old kits then. Uh, I I'm, I was just thinking maybe I should go visit her and you know just peruse her vault. <laughs> she really spooky <laughs> people. Really old kits. <laughs> She's got some heirlooms in there. She's got some antiques. <laughs> we need to dust off those antiques. <laughs> she goes, oh, okay. Well, I have to do that one too, LOL. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. We have some antiques. Okay. I'm trying limited, to limited editions. Limited editions, yeah, for real. For real. We have some really limited editions. Okay, where is that? I need to keep my Stamperia stuff together in one of those folders from, um, what do you call that place? Hobby Lobby. Uh, oh, she does? Oh, Johnny still has the video? That's good, young son. Yeah. Go check out her channel. Yep. Check out. Shadi has, she's been Oh, my God. Evelyn goes, I'm looking through the clutch kit, and I even have all the hardware. <laughs> Hardware. Oh God, the snap. Okay, so let me show. The first kit that I did was for the clutch was in 2016, and we had. Um, it was black. It was beautiful. May, what's Ch Chadi's channel name? Uh, her channel's name is Chadi Chadi Dollar, like the bill, dollar bill. Wow, you're surprising me. Young Sue says I still have Chadi's kit too. <laughs> no, yeah, Young Sue's been doing all her kits, and with this whole lockdown thing, Young Sue has been working on her kit because she was telling me she showed me the suitcase kit, and I'm like, uh, Young Sue, that's the suitcase kit. You people buying these kits and you're not making them. I'm coming to visit. Right. All right, let me show you. Um, so we did that. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you guys like that. That came out gorgeous. And then here is the clutch. Now this, I'm going to move this over because. Yeah, cover that so you don't get no paint or anything on it. Put a piece of paper or something. Now, let me move this. Let's move this, guys. Because yeah. I'm clumsy and cl I mean, clumsy. Like when it comes to clumsy, I'm um, I'm the girl. I'm I'm the girl that does the clumsiness. Okay. You know what my dad used to call my mother? What? She was clumsy. Gloto. Gloto? What the heck is gloto mean? Gloto means klutz. Gloto? I didn't know that. Yeah, that's the Spanish slang. You know, gloto. My mother hated that. All right. Okay, guys. Tired of seeing me clean? All pretty now. All pretty now. Look at what young Sue's. Between her and Evelyn, they need to open up a shop. Yeah, you got enough kids? I think young Sue has my, all my, I think she's bought every single one. Of, I, I, between young Sue, Tori Alexander, um, Miss Jackie Huff, 
um, Miss Carol Brickman, may she rest in peace. Um, they always bought my kits. Always. Okay, let's see. Okay, sorry. Oh, fantastic. This is it. This is from the garden center, the placement from Hobby Lobby. Um, they have it in ivory and they have it in this color. And I bought the um, ivory because we're going to do another project with the ivory. But basically, let me go look at the applique that I did in the first one that I did in 2016. That's pretty. That's a pretty little mat. And these will be available in the store. We haven't listed them. Uh-oh, look at that. Bam. It had something like this on the first one that we did. It looked like that. That should have been recorded. I don't know where what, what if it's in that computer that Eric has to get in here. It's because they off that computer and put it on an external drive and keep it in a safe place. So it goes something like that, that. Of course, it's gonna have more stuff than that, guys, because y'all know I like I like layers, and um, we might do something like that. So that, and it's a placemat. You can use any placemat, a Dollar Tree placemat, any placemat to make these clutch. Mm -hmm. It just um, use your laces and all your goodies. So we're going to do that next. Um, it's probably not going to be tomorrow. It all depends on how much fast reading I can do so that I can jump in tomorrow night and teach. If I don't get my reading done, then it's not tomorrow. Not if I get my reading done, then I'll, if, if I get my reading done, then it'll be tomorrow. If I don't get my reading done, it won't be until Friday. It all depends on how I, how fast I can get the stuff done. For this, these classes, I got a lot of reading that I have to do. A lot. They're not fun read. Well, they're, I, I kind of like the reading, though. And then as soon as that paper comes in, we're going to do the album. The paper comes in, we do the album. When the paper arrives, because I need, I need the SeaWorld paper. Evelyn yeah. says, well, I'm ready when you are. I'm not letting it go undone this time. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got plenty of time now because, you know, you guys, you're not working right now. Look what Rose says. Rose says, May, do your homework or your kids are going to ground you from YouTube. <laughs> Eric is going to ground her on you from YouTube. Eric is just as bad as I am. He, he's worse than me. He waits. In, like, Eric's very super smart, so he can wait till the last minute, whereas... Me and Carla, we read everything. Like I read everything. Michelle is asking you you did order the extras of the paper? I did order extras of the paper, but the paper that um because I had to do the album, um, I ordered it from someone else. Um, says, thank you, May, for sharing your wonderful artwork. And and the other Evelyn says no, I'm still working, teaching remotely. Oh, that's right. You guys have to teach remotely. How's that going? And Michelle says the paper for the album. Yeah. The paper for the album. Yes. I'm waiting on, I just ordered it from someone else. Um, so as soon as it comes, it was, as soon as it comes in, I will, um, I will show you guys. I will put the, we'll put the album together. Um, so that's in the agenda. That's in our agenda. And we have an organizer that's in an agenda. We have a travel suitcase that's in our agenda. Problem is that we also have a little troll that likes to jump in. and. Evelyn says, don't ask as to how it's going. <laughs> Probably, I can't imagine because you're a kindergartner student. Or, I mean, teacher, not student, teacher. You know what right? they did to the kids over here? They sent, the, they sent uh, Lily has to go pick up packets. She has to go every week and pick up packets. Does Lily have internet? Yeah, but they're not doing that because not everybody over here has internet and and uh, computers. So 
they are sending them uh, packets. They you go, you drive up, and they toss the packet in your car. Um, Rose is asking, how many of the House of Roses did you get? Save me one, please. I will. Um, I ordered um, six. Um, House of Roses. Um, I think I ordered six, if I'm not mistaken. Now save her one, save Rose one. I normally like to put 12 of everything, but when it's not something that typically, like I, I like I told my husband and I told Carla, I don't like to, you know, keep small quantities. I've never liked, when I've stocked up the store, when the store was mine before, I would put a couple dozen because that's just how I am. Um, but, you know, it's Carla's stuff. They didn't provide laptops for the elementary and middle school. The, 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 the money isn't there, but the high schoolers do have tablets. Excuse bless me, guys. You. I'm allergic to dust. Bless you, bless you. That's why I'm always like, I like to say these, you know why? Because... I don't know. You can. There's. It wouldn't matter if they gave them a, a a computer or a tablet because not everybody here can afford the internet. Right. Um, I like using this, and I'm going to show you why I like using this. One, you can use them for this little shaker cards. Rose says, "Let her know as soon as they come in. She knows she wants at least three different paper packs." Okay. You're. You're. I'll let you know. Um. As soon as they're in, I will let you know. Um, so I'm going to show you something about these. The yeah, other I, was, I was hoping for the the um, internet people company, whatever the cable company would offer some some kind of service for the kids so, so they can have access. They're to supposed them. to. They're not not here. They're supposed to. Most schools are offering. Most schools. I'm going to say most schools. The only company we have here is Blue Ridge, and they're not doing anything for anybody. I'm going to show you guys something. So this side, you can use it for, like, shaker cards. Ooh. But the other side. Let's see if we can get some good colors in here. Maybe I can just go like that. Let's see. You can use it like a stamp. Look at that. There she goes, folks. Bonus, bonus project. And then it can be wiped easily. Look at that. I see. Save your little um, thingies. They're great for shaker cards. And if you don't want to make a shaker card, use like something like that. You can make a cute little stamp out of it. It's so affordable because it's it's just this, it's you know the backing of your packaging. You know. Uh, it says cool look for some jelly plates. Michelle says that also makes nice wheels or inks to paint with. Yeah, and you can also use them up like this here for your palette for your paint palettes. So it has multiple uses. You can make a shaker, paint palette, stamp. Um, you can use it for your gel press. You can use it for all that. Um, these things are so Awesome. And then the other part, you can use them for tags. Like I save all these things. Or, and molds. You can make buttons. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. You could use for buttons. So save all that stuff, guys. Don't throw your stuff away. Especially not now when things are just kind of hard. We have to be innovative. You try that technique, and I use my pencil eraser to mark it in the middle. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, our area, the, the people here, they don't have means to have all the technology. And now that the libraries are clo closed, forget it. I know. Here the library is closed. 
you know, but here they're offering those parents that can't afford the internet. And then this little packaging, guys, gosh, this, this came from that um, Graphic 45 album. Easy peasy. This is a quick and easy little trifolio. Um, that you can cover up with a, a napkin, mm -hmm. make a pocket, or a rice paper, or even cardstock, whatever you have. Evelyn says, I use those plastic to make covers for bottle cap shakers to make charms. Ooh, very yeah, good. there you go. See? Mm -hmm. There's so much you can do that. I mean, there's, it's sad. I need to make sure my grandson has a printer. I will do that tonight. Aw. I know it is very sad times. You know, it's, it's, it's an adjustment, definitely an adjustment. Thank God for the internet, guys. Can you imagine if there was no such thing as the internet? Can you imagine what would have happened if there was no internet? I mean, Guys, it's only been two hours and 21 minutes, and we finished two tiles and this? Yep. Are you serious? Yep. And I've shown you guys, I've cleaned up, I've done everything. Oh, my God. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm, I'm amazed with myself, guys. Sometimes I can amaze myself. So, yeah, this is the packaging for that... Um, it came in that album from Graphic 45. I'm going to decoupage this, and this is this will make a cute, you can put a little um, hole here and here in an eyelet, put one of those elastic bands, put a little album in here. First, you're going to uh, decoupage it, and then, gosh, guys, you have a nice little cover, you know? Right. Amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. So, yeah, we're going to work on um, um, where have I lost my train of thought? Pop, pop, pop. Wow, we just got to notice, just got to notice that Philadelphia schools will remain closed indefinitely. Oh, my God. We are closed until May 4th. Mm -hmm. May 4th. They keep extending it over here. They keep extending it because the governor is just not, you know, our governor is in a wheelchair. He is in a wheelchair. Um, and so our governor is like, he's taking some serious precautions. And the reason being is because... He's in a wheelchair, you know. He's got to take those serious precautions. Wow. That means till next year. That's how how my grandkids' school is too closed for the rest of the year. Wow. This is a serious adjustment. This is like this is like real real deal stuff you know the real deal it's the real deal guys all right so let's plan ahead let's plan we got the book box the album is not done Uh, we're doing a clutch, a train suitcase for my little troll out there to see. Really? Evelyn says they're predicting the second round of the virus to happen in November. Wow. Yeah, I had heard something like that. There's something else that's coming after this. Um, we're going to try, we're going to alter this, alter...
And I, I realize tomorrow is April 1st. April Fool's is tomorrow. Mm -hmm. what, why am I putting that on this one? This day is the last day for this month. See, that's why I always write in pencil. All right. I'm horrible with keeping um, daily lists. Look at that. I'm Look at this. You got a whole shebang, and I don't even keep track of any of this stuff. I'm bad with calendars. Good night, Evelyn. Good night, Miss Evelyn. All right, so we're going to do... Um, the other Evelyn is asking, is that, is that a happy planner? I'm currently using about six of them, LOL. Um, I have no idea. I got it on sale from, um, yep, happy planner. I got it on clearance. But look, I didn't even do the first couple months. I'm not good at keeping track of anything that I'm going to do. We got to do the album for the book box in April. Uh, SeaWorld. A clutch. Organizer. Uh, a, tra a train suitcase. Evelyn said she's the planner girl. I'm not. I'm I'm bad at this. I just keep a plain notebook and write things in. I don't get too fancy. I'm going to use my calendar on my phone or on my wall. I think that'll be good. That's what our planner looks like an art journal. That's cool. Yeah. You know, I got all these wonderful stickers. Mm -hmm. Today is, hey, girl, mm -hmm. let's let's put a sticker on here because, you know, buy all this stuff. It's already April 1st for, for Honeybee. It is? Oh, there we go. Fro says, I make lists and then I lose the list. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's me. Mm -hmm. That's me. And then and then if I don't do it, it's like I start it, but I have all the intentions of the world of doing it. Mm. Just doesn't happen. Why night? No, no, no. Work hard, girl. Be awesome. We're going to be awesome. Tomorrow's an awesome day. It's not April Fool's tomorrow. It's my daughter's. Uh, my daughter's birthday month. Oh, wow. On uh, Miguel's, too. Yep, on the 15th. But he says his birthday is canceled because usually it's he's on the 15th, so that's tax day. So since they canceled tax day, he says that he celebrates. Now he's going to celebrate his birthday in June when we do the taxes. <laughs> he cracks me up, this kid. Yes, it's another form of creative expression while being organized. Yeah, it is, but I'm not that organized. I lack in that department. Mm -hmm. I am horrible, and I tell you guys, horrible. I like things organized and whatever, and sometimes I just put things away and then I forget them, but most of the time I'm pretty organized. I'm not, and I'm not, I'm, I'm being honest. I'm not going to, mm -hmm. I'm not going to um, sugarcoat it because I'm not. God didn't make me to be organized. No, he made you to be creative. He made me to be disorganized. You know, that's, that's what he made me for. Okay, so I got to remember that we're going to be doing um, a clutch this week. Evelyn says, I like the decorating more than the planning. <laughs> yeah, I think so. This week we're going to do a clutch and it's probably going to be Friday, depending on how my reading goes um, between tomorrow and Thursday and it'll probably be Friday the clutch. We'll see how that, that works. Okay. But I want to keep these stickers next to me because, you know, there was a reason why I bought this stuff. Mm. You know what they say, out of sight, out of mind. Yep. <laughs> If I don't see it, like, look at, look at that. Well, to be fair, I got it at the end of 
uh, January, I think it was January 30th or February 1st around that time. So it's not my fault. I blame, I blame, I blame Hobby Lobby didn't put this on sale till then. Then goes, yay, clutch, clutch, clutch. <laughs> I like the rings on that planner. It is because it's refillable. No, but I mean the, it, the color. It's like a, a metallic, at least it's coming across metallic on my screen. Mm -hmm. It's a refillable one. There's no reason why I can't do it. It's just a reason of that I'm lazy. I, that I'm that's the biggest problem is I'm I'm lazy guys. Forgetful, lazy, not consistent on these things. My mom used to keep good calendars. She wrote everything down in calendars. All right, guys. I think that about does it for us. Um well, Evelyn says those metallic discs cost a lot. They are a hot commodity. The what does? The those metallic discs, they're hot. They're you know, they're uh, popular. Oh, are they? In the planner world, I guess. Yeah. They sell them separately? I guess see that that just tells you how much I don't know. Mm -hmm. I didn't know they sold those separately. Yeah, they do. Good night, Patricia. Good night, Miss Patricia. Thank you so much for hanging in there. Please and have thumbs on the way out. And when you have a chance, come back, please, and leave a comment. Yes, guys, leave a comment. You guys aren't leaving me a comment. That You know what's happening right now is that YouTube is punishing little channels like myself, and they're not allowing. If you guys notice, there's barely any views on my channels, on my channel, and that's because YouTube is not, it's not wanting to share my channel. If, I, I think if they don't see comments, yeah, they're not, they're not pushing the channel up. They're not pushing the channel up. Yeah, that's 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 exactly what it is. So I need you guys to please leave some comments on the channel after it takes about five minutes. Um, yeah, yeah, you gotta wait, Michelle. You gotta wait for it to upload completely after we sign off and come back. Yes, and then see the spot at the bottom to put the comment. Yeah, be safe, guys. I want you guys all to be safe, but please, because something is happening with YouTube, and as you guys can see, um, it's just not, it's just, YouTube is not pushing me out there, and I got a notification from StreamYard, so I don't know what all that entails, but, um, you know. What's going to happen is it, if, if they keep seeing, you know, no comments and likes and, or view hours or whatever, they're just going to keep pushing you down the, the search list and it won't. And it doesn't matter right. if you got right. the bell clicked on your notifications because I'm still waiting to see May is live on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's they're just trying to get rid of us small channels. That's what they're doing. They're trying to get rid of us, guys. Michelle says the last three videos, the comment slot was gone. Huh. See what I mean? It's just, I think they're, I honestly, I honestly, honestly, because I've been in where my video doesn't look like, uh, it's not even in the back for me. The video that I just finished making is not in the back. I, I need to start recording. The problem is, is that my computer's not um, making good sound. Um, and even if I did recording, Who's to say that I'm going to get a view, you know? Mm. So don't forget, guys. Don't forget to leave a little a little comment just so that YouTube doesn't think that my account is not important or my channel is not important enough. And please share the, the, the live videos on your pages so people see and come. And I think it's because um, I think, you know, with everything that's happening, um you know they had to let go of a lot of people in google they don't have anyone monitoring these channels so you know they can close yeah, their channels. watch hours michelle but if there's no comment on the videos yeah it, they seem to be using that as a as a marker as an algorithm yeah it's a yeah. it's a marker for algorithm has to do with the algorithm thank you rose so, yep, guys. 
guys, I'm tired. I'm yeah. off of here. Thank you so much for coming in. Good night, everybody. Guys in the next video. Bye. Bye, everybody. Have a good night. Stay safe. Bye. Yes, please be safe. Till next time, guys. Bye-bye. Okay.